Having trouble launching Call of Duty Black Ops 6 on Steam? In this video, we'll go through- First open your start menu and type GeForce Experience. Open GeForce Experience. Click on Call of Duty. Press Optimize. Now launch your game. If you use Steam, right-click Call of Duty, select Properties, select Installed Files, click on Verify Integrity of Game Files. Now wait for Call of Duty to be repaired. Now launch your game. First press the Windows key plus R, type devmgmt.msc and then press OK, Expand Display Adapters. Right-click your display adapter. Select Properties. Go to the Driver tab. Click on Update Driver. Click on Search Automatically for Driver Software. Wait for the update to be installed. You can also click on Search for Updated Drivers on Windows Update. First, Google GeForce Experience. Click on GeForce Experience. Press Download Now. Save the file. Run the installer. Press Yes. Now install the program. First, open the link that you'll find in the description of this video. Download the x86 version. Download the x64 version. Now run vc underscore dist x86. Accept the terms and press install. Press yes. Close the installer. Now run vc underscore dist x64. Accept the terms and press install. Press yes. Close the installer. Restart your PC to finish the installation. First, open the link that you'll find in the description of this video, click on Download, save the file, now run the file. Press Yes. Press Unzip to extract the program. Wait for the files to be extracted, press OK. Press Yes. Press Download and install this feature, wait for the feature to be installed. If you use Steam, right-click Call of Duty, select Properties, open Installed Files, press Browse. This will be the location of your COD executable. Now that you know the location, open the Start menu and type Graphics Settings. Open Graphics Settings. Select the Desktop app and press Browse. Now look for your COD executable. Double-click on your COD executable to add it. Press Options. Select High Performance. Press Save. If you use Battle.net, just do the same thing. 